I think for me, it's where it is in the middle of London. It's such a wonderful um, place for the kinds of courses that we teach and we use all of the resources that, that London has. It's wonderful for our creative writers as a source of inspiration, but it's a great place to go to the galleries and museums and to look at the other kinds of cultural production that's going alongside the, the literature and other texts that we're studying so it's a fantastic place and we have a fantastic um, student body as well the, the students here are um, they're what really make the university unique they are um, independent um, original thinkers they're um, they're a, a real real pleasure to teach the kinds of students that, that come here Uh, I did my undergraduate degree and my PhD at the University of London um, on 19th century literature in English and I've been here at the University of Westminster for a really long time now. Um, I think this is my 25th year since I started and I'm now head of the Department of English Linguistics and Cultural Studies in this Faculty of Social Sciences and Humanities. I teach on the um, Single Honours English Literature course, but also on the combinations. We've got a number of different combination courses in the department. Um, but the modules that I teach on, um, this year I'm teaching Victorians to the first year undergraduates. I'm teaching our Gothic option module in the second year. And I also teach on our MA courses and supervise PhD students as well. Well, the wonderful thing about the English courses that we have is that they are uh, courses that you can really transfer to any area of interest and, and future careers. So we've had such a wide range of uh, careers that graduates have gone into. I started uh, work a long time ago. My research was on 19th century literature and I became interested in the literature and culture of the late 19th century when lots of unusual texts started being published um, and one of those was Dracula, published in 1897, um, and I did part of my PhD um, writing about Dracula, and so that's a long-standing interest in kind of vampires and monsters and um, the strange figures of um, literature. At the moment, I'm working on um, archaeology and 19th century culture. Um, and I became interested in that through monsters as well, through um, mummies and curses and some of the um, the kinds of uh, stories and um, films that arise from um, archaeological objects, old artefacts and the kinds of dramatic events that, that come along with um, people usually messing around with those things. So that's what I'm working on at the moment is looking at the ways in which archaeology features in 19th century literature and culture.